I don't want to be placed into a category just because of the number inside of my pants. I also don't want to be told that I'm not good enough or pretty enough because I have cellulite. My cellulite's pretty cute. The more you're vulnerable with the people that you're sharing with, the easier it is to love who you are. So that's why I always tell women, just be who you are. Don't retouch your photos. Talk to yourself in the mirror. It's only gonna change your attitude towards your body. I think what's happened for me is over time, I've really just looked in the mirror, I've told myself, you are bold, you are brilliant, and you are beautiful. And I say, I am, because anything that I say, I am, after is. So all of my fans and, and the women who follow me, I kind of just think of us all as sisters and we're in this game together. We're in this game of being told we're too fat or too ugly, not good enough, not worthy of the world that we are living in. And I think that you know, if all it takes is me just giving my personal story and talking about the hurdles that I've had to go through, then that's all that matters. But when you put a photo that's unretouched on Instagram and then you get people saying, you're fat or you're a hippo, you're making fat cool, you're gonna kill someone. That was a comment that will never leave my mind. What happens is you get a few of those and you get a lot of the good comments. And it's women and it's men saying like, finally, I'm seeing something that I look like when I look in the mirror. And it doesn't matter if you're a size two or if you're a size 22. Everybody has something that they don't really truly love about themselves. And it's nice to see that in somebody else. Hello today fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives.